Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Halloween! So whilst you are watching this video, I am actually in Disneyland Paris! Woo! But what I thought I'd do before I go to get me excited is to get another Happily Ever After box. And the special thing about this box is it's Halloween themed! So let's just get right into it, same as last time. Same, just paper cardboard box there. There are some stickers here, so we've got uh, Jasmine right here from Aladdin, and then my my girl Ariel at the bottom. So I'm actually very prepared because I have my sharp object. Don't know what they are, but they're sharp, so that's all we need to do. So let's get started. Now, I don't know about you, but Halloween is my favourite time of the year to visit the Disney parks. I mean, Christmas is very magical, but um, Halloween is just, I don't know, something near and dear to my heart, basically. I've actually been to Disneyland Paris at Halloween. I've only ever been to Walt Disney World, so it will be an amazing experience. Um, to see how this is the first time. So. Right, let's get this box cracked open. Uh, trim it. Right, so this time, let's get this open. Oh, ah, this is so cool. So I kind of want to show you guys what's inside the book. So this is a pretty huge box. So if you can kind of see, it's full to the brim with Disney goodies. And if you can see as well, they're all wrapped up. So it's like lots and lots of presents I get to open and that's everyone's favourite is presents and it just looks amazing so I'm gonna just get stuck right in. So the first thing we have is, it's time to show off your nails, salon looking nails, okay. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how to apply these but I'm going to investigate it as much as possible because they are, if you can see, Mickey and Minnie. Halloween nail stencil arts. Oh my goodness! Do, 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 do. Oh, Cruella Deville face mask. Oh, oh, oh. So it's a peel off face mask. It's all in. Um, I don't want to offend anyone, but it's in a language I can't read. I'll just say that much. I maybe have to Google what to do with it. But I didn't know they made these, so that's really cool. Yeah, so second one here is there's a little sticker Snow White and the Prince on the front. So, let's open this so, what is this? Oh, oh my goodness, I've never heard of this before. It's called Once Upon Halloween. Oh, I'm gonna watch it later. Oh. Every heroic story must have a villain, and the Disney villains are the best to ever appear on screen. Join the evil queen from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs as she scares up some of the most memorable villains and villainous moments in Disney history. Where was this when I was, you know, doing my dissertation, which was all on Disney villainy? I, this would have been perfect. They made. What's this? Oh, that's cute. So it's a little uh, leaflet from the 2017 not so scary Halloween party from America. Fun fact, my one of my really good friends was actually in Disney World when the hurricane, the massive hurricane hit and um, she went to the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party and she brought me back some limited edition uh, Disney pens. So I've the Mickey Mouse with um, which is the official one for the party and my favorite part is the fact that his fangs are little candy corns and then I also have a limited edition Ursula um, like open front pin with which is the cauldron pin set which was the special um, pin for the party so I absolutely adored her for that and the fact that she was there and you know risked her life in a hurricane to give me some pins. Little one! Get this open. Oh it's so cute! Little Sally earrings. Let's get this on. I'm gonna put this on straight away. If my earring hole hasn't 
haven't closed. I don't know about you guys, but Halloween to me does not start until you've watched this movie with these ladies, the Sanderson sisters. Pocus Pocus, greatest Halloween film, almost greatest film like ever, love Halloween, love Hocus Pocus, and now I get to wear it in my hair like a hair tie. Oh. I'll put this back in here. Oh my gosh, it's great. That's amazing. This is an this is an authentic, proper Disney Parks lanyard, and it's Halloween themed, and it's orange on the other side, and it's just got bats and Mickey heads and stuff. This is my favourite thing I've ever done in my life. Oh my god. This is great. See, got me got got me now because I was gonna go I was gonna go into the parks and I was gonna buy a lanyard for the 25th anniversary. But now I have this one. And it's amazing. Maybe I can alternate them. Gives me an excuse to buy more pins. Yeah. Three pins. I have three pins. I have three pins. Okay. Calm. Oh, wow. Okay, so I have this maleficent, like candy corn type pin. That's uh, candy corn, candy apple pin. And then I have this chin pin, chin pin of Hades himself. And then also have. The Lady of Evil, Maleficent. Her chin, her chin. See, Maleficent. Oh, I'm so happy with these. These are fantastic. See, see, more things to go on my lanyard. Just to show them off, essentially. There we are, put them safe. They will go on my board. I won't do them right now, because I'm running out of room. As you can see, I'm really, re really running out of room. I'm having to relocate things in different places, so. This is the greatest thing about Happily Ever, Happily Ever After boxes is that like 90% of it is wrapped in paper so you don't know what it is like when you've opened it. It's not like, oh, there's a box of cool stuff. It's, oh, it's a box of presents. It's great. Let's get this. See this, most people would just like hang this on their door or something. This is going on my Christmas tree. This is fantastic, so. My other villain ears that I have is actually this lovely lady because I adore Alice in Wonderland so much. And now I have this. Oh, it's so great. It's fantastic. I'm gonna hold it up. I'll do close-ups again so you guys can see everything. By Enchanted Tiki Design. And it's just, it's just perfect gonna be my Christmas tree ornaments I'm not gonna lie I probably keep it up all year round however definite Christmas tree it's really odd that the Christmas tree decorations that I have are a lot of villains and a lot of Halloween I have a Halloween Christmas tree pretty much oh, I'm gonna start having a Halloween tree sorted Halloween tree it is so if you can hear a whirring noise in the background there that's my um, my mother she's sewing actually making a, my, my Rapunzel costume <laughs> that I'm wearing right now actually well maybe not right now depends when you guys are watching this obviously um, but check out my Instagram because there will be lots of pictures going up about that so and I'll put the link below the Biatch herself Mother Gothel she's such an underrated villain she stole a child she stole a child to kind of eat her essence. She stole my favourite, my girl, my pencil. But still. Is it messed up that I would have a picture in a frame of the evil villain of like my favourite princess? Who knows? I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say it's great. I'll swap legs because I've got terrible pins and needles and I'm gonna rearrange. I've still got like a crap ton left in this box. Like I've barely scratched the surface. Look at this, literally barely scratched the surface. It's like fingers in, that's it. This is great. Okay, so, oh, there's unopened or 
I should say, unwrapped. Yeah, socks. Mistress of Evil herself. I'm actually wearing, I don't know if you can see, my Team Villain t-shirt at the moment. And for those of you who do shop in Asda, yes, it is a um, <coughs> pyjama top. But that's fine. Bad girl, bad girls, talking about sad girls. Bad girls. It's like a flannel or a towel or something. But it's the Haunted Mansion! It's like one of my favorite rides! Uh, haunted Mansion, I'll do close-ups. Look how cool it is. It's so cool! Uh, that probably won't even be used as a towel. That will go on display somewhere. I would wallpaper my room with this if I could. And it wasn't so dark, because it is quite dark. I'm well impressed. Impressed.com. Yeah, I did just .com it. Boom. Guys, <clears throat> I have to show you just just what's made me so excited. Oh no, it's moved. Like I don't know what it is. I just got it slow on it, and I want to look at it so bad. But I've got other stuff to look at first. Okay. Oh, it's a plushie. It's a Pooh Bear plushie! Oh, look how cute he is! I love plushies. I love them so much. If you could look around my room, you'd see how much I love plushies. I can see my little Duffy here. My little pumpkin Duffy. He's great. And now I have a little Pumpkin Poo. Pumpkin Poo! I'm just going to start a collection of pumpkins that are Disney pumpkins. Done. Life. Life goal. Yum. Ask by some sweeties. This box is a, a UK box. And it's gummy candy corn from Walt Disney World. This year. Oh, look at it. We can prove it because the best before is until 2018. I will eat these. I'm going to take these with me and then eat them in Disneyland on Halloween. That's what I'm going to do with these. This is just the best thing I've ever done. It's amazing. I'm gobsmacked. Like, I love my Rapunzel box, but holy hell, this is incredible. It's gonna take forever to open. And ever and ever and ever. Unravel, unravel. <laughs> That's really cute. All of the unraveling, and it's a little mini Mastro. It's cool in her witch's outfit. I don't like that in the Disney, in the in Europe Disney at the moment, the Mickey and Minnie plushes are spiders. Because Minnie is a witch, and she's always a witch. So why can't they have her as a witch? I'm really excited. I love twisty straws. They make drinking so much more fun. There's a, there's a, there's a this. So let's open whatever this is first. Oh, look! It's a picture of the gang from the Hundred Acre Wood, all dressed up. That's so cute. Based on Winnie the Pooh works. I love Winnie the Pooh. I have all the Winnie the Pooh books. He's just adorable. And now I have this, which is literally going to go, I'm going to put it into some books to make it flat, and then it's going to go in a frame, and it's going to go on my wall. This is beautiful. Oh, this is the last thing in the box, ready? Are you ready? Because I'm really excited. Rid of that. Boom. Look at this bad boy. Chilling, chilling, chilling. Like a Have you guys seen that new film? It's pretty good. It's not amaze balls, but I enjoy it. And this looks like it's been made out of a like a, a tote bag. I've never seen this tote bag before. 
This is gonna go on my bed and I'm just gonna keep it all year round because the villains are the best thing ever. Love Disney villains. I'm so happy. Okay, so that's it. And thank you so much for sharing again in my excitement in opening up my Happily Ever After box. And it made it all the more special this time because it is Halloween themed and Halloween is one of my favorite things in the whole world, especially when it involves Disney because nobody does Halloween like the Disney parks, if any of you know if you've been there. If you fancy checking out what is going on at Disneyland Paris over the Halloween season, um, check out my Instagram because I will be posting up pictures throughout the day also from the soiree if you are obviously want to take a look at uh, our costumes we've also got some Disney bound plans and things like that I'll be uh, updating as much as I can whilst out there and if you guys do have anything that you really want to see that you want me to film then please please put it in the comments because I'll be happily to do anything if there's any like merchandise or any shops you want to have a bit of a look around in uh, and you're not sure and um, you know it's Christmas time coming up so if there's any Christmas merch you're going at Christmas and you want to have a look what's in the parks drop me a line down there and I'll be able to take a look um, at that for you I'm more than happy because I will be vlogging my whole trip whilst I'm there um, and be putting those up when I come back and then I'll also be vlogging um, in the end of November when I go back for a week um, for my brother's birthday at Christmas so keep your eyes peeled for lots and lots more content on its way to you thank you so much again for watching this video and I hope you have a spooktacular Halloween